Right, Matt, thanks. Now to the latest on that deadly shootout with police officers today in Spyro. The situation began unfolding yesterday when a person shot at a, a police officers near the city's Harp store. Today, the suspect opened fire on officers again, this time near the city's police department. LaFleur County Sheriff Rodney Derryberry tells us suspect was pronounced dead following that shooting today. Five News reporter Rachel Williams spoke with the suspect's family and has the latest. Police tell us the suspect Damian Henderson shot again at police officers just blocks from the Spiral Police Department. The LaFleur County Sheriff says Henderson was pronounced dead at the Mercy Hospital in Fort Smith. This all started when authorities say suspect Damian Henderson had opened fire at officers around 7.30 Wednesday night at the Harps Grocery Store on Broadway Street in Spiro. They caught Damian last night. Why wouldn't he handcuffed? If they would have handcuffed him and put him in the car, this would have never happened. If he was, they felt he was that much danger when he got out that house, why didn't you handcuff him? As police were searching for Henderson, Spyro police say he shot at officers Thursday afternoon. Officers returned fire, hitting Henderson in the stomach. Five News spoke to Damien's grandma, and she says he struggled with mental illness. Damien, I guess he just snapped and said, well, if you're going to shoot me, I'll shoot you first. You know, so because anybody can tell you, Damon don't bother anybody. He likes his dogs. He likes his bicycle. Neighbors, family, and friends say they were shocked to hear Damien was involved in the shooting. When I heard about this, I said, wait a minute. This is kind of out of his character. This is not the Damien that I know. He doesn't deserve this. I've never heard anything bad, negative about Damon. I just know he loved his dogs. He didn't bother anyone. I, I worked at Sparrow School and I've never heard a bad thing about Damien. Police say this is an ongoing investigation and OSBI is assisting with the case. But for now, I'm in Spyro covering news where you live. Rachel Williams, 5 News.